All right, it's time for us to continue this Irk settlement. All right, so now I think we're at the point now. Um, we're gonna go ahead and let the let the folks go out and start collecting some stuff. Um, go ahead and get some uh, stuff prepared. Let's see here. Um, where are we at on our storage? We're at sixty-one out of eighty. Gas is we got up to fifty-five on gas. Um, everyone, well, okay, they're not super happy. There are infestations. Um, is power nap rested? Power nap? All right, buddy. Um, time to send you to legacy. Is uh day ninety? Um, where you at, power nap? Time for me to. Let's see, let me get a, there's a pistol for you, and a machete or something like that. So we'll give you, uh, let's see, what pistol do we want to give Power Nap? Um, we'll give Power Nap this pistol here, uh, which is a 9mm. We'll give him some 9mm ammo to go along with that. Um, we'll go ahead and... Reload. Oh, I guess I could have done that. Uh, let's go ahead and reload. All right. Go ahead and give him that, and then give him the. Uh, no, give him a, a fencing tool. All right. <clears throat> No, yeah, we aren't. You might be. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what you're. Uh... Oh, I already took your stuff. Oh, okay. Never mind. Um, but here, you know what? I'll give you some more ammo for your journey. All right. And hasta luego. Hasta la taco. Bon voyage. Damn, he's all an ass. I don't think I've ever seen him run so fast before. All right, put these away. All right, um, let's go ahead and swap over to you. We're gonna have uh, do some stuff. Um, so on this map here, okay, so let me see here. Um, she's been a leader, and she's been a leader, she's been a leader, and she's been a leader. She's being saved for the next difficulty. He's going to be on next difficulty. So we have a uh, a, a trader and a warlord, and then she's got a sheriff. So I think we'll make Dylan our leader on this map. Um, but we're not going to make him leader just yet. We'll have him take control though. Hey, that freak might be trouble. And let's grab a. Uh, Where's Collins at? Actually, you know what? Where's Cole at instead? Hey, Cole. Congrats. You're still alive. Come with me. Hey, could you uh, give me a hand here? All right. We're gonna leave the infestations brew for a while. Um, let's go clear out. Um, let's. Let's see here. Just great. A juggernaut. Ooh, a juggernaut. Ooh, juggernaut. Uh, let's hit this billboard and then we'll uh, search out this side of the road here. Grab that gas. Hey, there's a feral lurking nearby. No, a feral lurking nearby. That there is of concern. I mean, I, I kind of wish we could get rid of the uh, 
the bleachers. Um, just so we didn't have to waste ammo on them sniping. Uh, let me see here. How's the fuel? Yeah, we need fuels. We need fuel fuelage. And let's just do a regular repair. All right, let's go. You in here? Okay. Sorry. Chang distracted me. All right, so start up here at the gas station. And the loot, uh, grab its uh, rucksack. So, the rucksack, uh, I mean, we'll, we'll do a, a full search on it, but. Yep, that's a keeper. Yes, it is a keeper. Hey, how's it going this evening? <laughs> how's your, how'd your uh, tearing it down game go yesterday? I saw you, uh, saw you uh, messing around with that last night, or was it last night, night before last? I think I hear more of them. You need to find a game called, um, Building it up or something. Actually, you know what? I got the perfect game that you need to play. Oops, uh, let me see here. Uh, where is it? Uh, you know, yeah, because this will go. Uh, this will go well with your uh, um, your move. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> yeah, I've seen that. I saw that game on uh, Tear It Down. I saw that on Steam. Uh, I think I don't remember how long ago it was. Or, or something very similar to it. I don't remember. Um, I mean, that's something. I mean, there's got to be something satisfying with tearing stuff down, though, right? Even if, uh, even if it's not for the intended audience. Uh, oh wait, there's a fuel thing robber right here too. <laughs> that all you got? I was, I was thinking. There's a game I was thinking. Um. Oh, that, that would be almost perfect. I can see you uh, enjoying, and now I can't remember what it was. Damn, that's heavy. A lot of rucksacks. Yeah, this is my last map before I uh, head up to the dread level. I gotta, gotta bank up as much stuff as I can. <laughs> not, not with my main community. I mean, if you want to play, I can jump to a different community. Um, this is 
This is my prime 90 day plus community. <laughs> I think I just found my next ride. Uh, an ambulance? Uh, if an ambulance is your next ride, I don't know if uh, you got something to talk about or not there, buddy. Yeah. Uh. How much, uh, how much packing do you, do you gotta do? I mean, cause you're just doing a local move, right? But then again, I've done local moves too and there's a lot of packing. Um, Doesn't look like much here. All right, let's see here. Uh, I'm gonna take that. <laughs> well, I mean, for 90% of my moves in my life, you know, it was, you know, a full move and, you know, I actually had the movers come and, or not, not, not a full move, excuse me, because uh, they're all full moves. Um, it wasn't a local move, so it's like, I let the movers come in, you know, other than the clothes that were in a suitcase. Um, you know, I let the, the packers come pack everything up and do it themselves, you know, the professional way. Um, but for when I did my local move, um, yeah, I think I took, uh, my, my parents helped me out. Um, we loaded a U-Haul van up and, uh, Moved probably 90, 95% of stuff, uh, but exactly, uh, I had the, um, had the, the, you know, actual movers come in for the, the heavy items, um, which actually was only like, I think, a couch, um, I think I had them do the bed just so they would disassemble it and reassemble it, um, you know, but, you know, like you said, the heavy objects. Uh, oh, there's a zombie still remaining? Where's your zombie at? I hear him on the outside, I think. Oh yeah, there you are. Ah, uh, see, and those... So, so, I tell you, so it's actually a real desk, not one of those uh, particle, board, plywood, put it to, uh, you know, assemble it yourself desks. Um... Don't need that, and don't need that. <clears throat> now actually, I, I, I think I, I need to get myself a new desk. Actually, what I really need is I gotta, gotta get a new chair. This chair is like we just finished five years old or so, and it's even better if we put some time for, uh, time for it to get replaced, I think. No, I was, uh, I was thinking uh, on that last stream you played when you were playing, um, what do you call it? Um, Walking Dead. Last stream, I actually was sitting in the stream and watching uh, when you were doing the Walking Dead game. Uh, I was going to say, see, the lighting in that stream, you know, because you were saying something about how, how you didn't like the lighting in uh, uh, in some of your streams, I guess, and how dark it was or something like that. It's like that lighting you had on that stream actually was pretty good. Well, I wouldn't say it was, was it color correction? Cause it, it just looked brighter for some reason. Um, yeah, I mean, if that's what it was, then that's cool. I mean, but like I said, it just seemed, Seems so much brighter on that stream. Um, I mean, not, not 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 overly bright, but I mean, like a like a good good light level. Um, all right, uh, let's see. 
And I, I don't know if you caught my message uh, at the last. Um, I don't know if you caught my message when you uh, you jumped in my stream. Uh, I think it was a briefly uh, day before yesterday or something like that. Um, I was gonna say, uh, uh, and I think your one of your mods. Um, um, well, your mods mentioned it also, but you had a super amount of patience. Um, a lot of patience with that one person. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's like, how many times in a five minute thing can you tell us your age? It's like, okay. Um, my miss. Yep, that's a bloater. Uh, I'm missing. Oh, the roof. Forgot about this place has a roof. Yeah, no, I mean, I, I, I'll give you that. Um, I mean, and I would, I would tend to believe that um, empty. A, a woman with a webcam. Versus a man without a webcam, um, you'd have you probably have the tendency of getting more creeps than I would. Um, all right, so this place is done. No, <laughs> what I what I crack up at is uh, I don't know um, what you use for your chat. I don't know if you have a like a. If you're what if you have a stream up, um, uh, you know, if you're watching your own stream or, uh, oh, you know, you don't, um, so, so what do you use for your, uh, um, what do you, what do you use for your, uh, your, your monitoring your chat in that stream labs? Um, let me see here. Oh, you're right next door. No, 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 no. I mean, I mean, I mean to read your chat. I'm sorry, not, not. Uh, maybe, maybe I misspoke. But um, what do you use to read the chat that people send you in the um, while you're streaming? So I, I, I use a program called uh, Chatty. I don't know if you've heard of it or not. Um, basically, it's just a. Um, uh, what do they call it? An IRC chat program thing. But I just crack up when I'm sitting here watching because uh, you can actually see people jumping in and jumping out, or not people. Nine times out of ten, you see the bots jumping in, and jumping out. Um, and there's a new set of bots that are called definitely not bots. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, in fact, I, I, I don't know if I, do I have a link? Um, Um, I don't actually have a link as far as my gaming specs per se, but uh, on that Discord, I don't know if you saw. I mean, there's. I mean, if if you're curious to see what it looks like, um, in the into the Discord, in my Discord, I actually have a uh, a section dedicated for that and and how to set it up. It's a good little program, um, because it you know you can actually see your viewer count if you want, and you can you know see. Uh, you know, normal chat. You can see your users. Uh, you can have a pop out for showing uh, um, open stream or uh, like streamers that you favorited or, or followed. I should say. Excuse me. Um, there's a pop out for that if you want to. You know, see who's who's uh, online. Um, you can actually have pop out chat windows if you know you're you know for like keywords that are you know if you say hey if you want to get my attention you know type steel or something like that you can actually have a pop out chat window for that and then anything that has the word steel in it will jump in uh appear in there and it's actually it's not a bad program i i don't remember uh who the streamer was that uh um was using it that um that introduced me to it but it's actually a nice little program Ooh. Hello, bloater and feral. Take that, you feral fuck. Oh, well, that's scary, that thing.
Yeah. Yeah. That, that, that would be amazing. <laughs> But I mean, I know uh, Twitch, uh, you know, they're trying to introduce their own, um, their own streaming software, um, which I don't know how many people are using that. Um, I, th I think it's supposed to be, uh, uh, I guess, um, I mean, I, I saw a preview video of it. I mean, it's just, I guess, a uh, very... Dumbed, dummy down version, you know, I mean, you can do the basics, you know, you can hook up a webcam and your microphone, um, uh, trying to find shot, okay. Um, I mean, it doesn't have all the bells and whistles of, you know, OBS or Streamlabs. Um, I mean, that's true. I mean, so for, for a person, you know, just starting out, um, for, for a person just starting out, you know, you know, it's a good tool to get into, you know, especially if they don't have the, uh, uh, the processing power, let's say to, you know, have OBS or Streamlabs running. Um, but it would be nice if, you know, you can, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know how YouTube is and cause I, I don't, uh, I don't multi-stream. Um, you know, I, I pretty much go straight to, straight to Twitch, you know, one and done. Um, so I don't know if Twitch or excuse me, YouTube has anything, uh, anything special with their stuff. Um, Make way for the cavalry. That guy's alive. Huh. Yeah, and that's, and I, and I, I've, I've heard that, and um, although I still know that I've seen people still do it. Um, how they get away with it, I don't know. Um, um, I mean, because here's the deal. It's Twitch has so many, uh, so many affiliates and, uh, partners, you know, that I don't think they have enough, you know, they don't have time, the staff to go check up on everyone. Um, and you know what, I'm like I said, I agree. I'm not gonna snitch, I mean, how? <clears throat> Cause that's, you know, that's on you. Um, or, or the streamer, you know, if you wanna, um, you know, multi-stream, you know, if you wanna do that and uh, Adios. potentially lose your affiliate or partnership, yeah. Um, yeah, that's, that's cool. Oh, am I, wait, is this the place where I'm supposed to go? Yeah, this is where I'm supposed to go. Uh, Oh, this is a local zombie nearby. Um, there you go. Now I can talk to him. You are a lifesaver. All right. All right, so we're to now. Let's see, as uh, up here, I got so got a roadblock and medicine up there. Um, all right, so we'll go and hit those two things real quick. Get some more goodies. I mean, I suppose so. Uh, for me, the one benefit if I were to multi-stream or just stream directly to YouTube is that uh, I wouldn't have to worry about uh, exporting my videos to YouTube to store them. Dude, you know you just left your buddy behind who came in the... Wow, that's kind of cold. He just left his buddy behind. Yeah, see now, that's one thing I haven't done. I haven't really done actual editing of my movies i mean there's there's a few special videos i've done um but i've never actually done true you know making pretty videos if you will i uh i got the software to do it um i just don't have the i guess the patience to do it uh nor do i know i guess what i would want to do you know so pretty much i just send my raw videos um 
I mean, so I mean, I could, you know, I could go through my videos and like cut out all my my starting screens and BRBs and ending stuff. Um, you know, I could do that. You know, uh, tr you know, trim that out. And, you know, I could clean it up. But again, there's so many videos. Um, it would it would take forever. But no, I did a. Uh, <coughs> I know, I know you haven't played the game yet, uh, and, I, and when you do, please let me know because I would I would love to uh, watch you play it. Uh, t talking about The Last of Us too, um, but I did a uh, um, I did a uh, what do you call it? Um, it's very it's curse heavy. That said, okay, so I'll, I'll say that without spoilers. And so I did a straight through session of that one day. Um, it was like my third or uh, third or fourth playthrough of it. Curse heavy, and let's just say they're dropping the f bomb quite a bit. Um, which I mean, I don't mind that. Um, it's an, I, I have this labeled as a mature stream, so I'm not worried about that. Um, but I was curious. I was like, okay. So I did a, a playthrough of it one day. Um, oh, YouTube didn't mind that either. Because, um, in fact, um, I actually get, uh, which was actually kind of weird. Now, their closed captioning doesn't like that. Um, but the. Um, the the video itself um um they didn't care about um but uh there was a uh so I, I did an 11 hour stream uh and i basically went and counted the f-bombs that were dropped and that was like one of the only videos that i actually did a special thing on kind of a uh, it's kind of kind of funny ish um, <laughs> but I turned 11 hours into three and a half minutes um, but, but that, that's I think the extent of my video editing I've done yeah pretty much um, that's what it basically boiled down to <laughs> Yeah, cause you know we've played out all the 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 you know all the curse words we have now. They pretty much don't mean anything like they used to. You know, certain words are still off limits. At least I won't use certain words, um, just cause yeah, they're you know. I don't know if I'd say they're taboo or or if you could or say they're disrespectful. I mean, they I mean, uh, it, it would be disrespectful. Um, yeah, that one there. Yeah, I leave that one alone. Um, and yeah, I mean, that that one in particular, I definitely leave alone. Um, <laughs> oh, I, uh, I mean, hell, just playing this game sometimes, I wanted to, uh, say that to one of my female community members, um, you know, and so I opted to go to bitch instead, which is, you know, um, sometimes it just makes me, sometimes what the characters in this game do is it just makes me scratch my head it's, and it really irks me when they step in front of me when i'm trying to do something that's it one that roadblock just had that thing of screws wow um is i'm just glad friendly fire i don't i don't even know if friendly fire now I'm actually kind of curious. Is friendly fire an option in this game? Um, I don't. I don't think I saw friendly fire, um, which is probably a good thing. Because um, the amount of times my companion, yeah, I don't, and I don't think it's under the difficulty level. Um, but the amount of times my companion has stepped in front of me while I've been trying to shoot a zombie, um, 
And, yo. Know, <laughs> you know, hey, now, self-censoring, nothing wrong with self-censoring. Um, oh, 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 okay, I, I get what you're saying. But actually, that's what you should say out loud. Um, or is that what you actually do? Is you say that instead of uh, the other variation. Um, <laughs> You know, if it wasn't for my companion diving out of the, the car, you know, that zombie would have tackled you. That still cracks me up why they dive out of the car like that. All right, turn that one off. Um, and actually, you know what, we'll keep, bump that up to level two. Yeah. Well, I mean, I, you know, I just, you know, it's, no, sometimes no, it's no, funny. No. Uh, sometimes it's annoying. Um, I, was, I don't remember what map it was, but I was driving around and there was some, uh, it was Trumbull, in fact, I remember it now, it's Trumbull Valley. I was driving around this side of the van here, I parked and there's uh, some bushes right here. And for whatever reason, those bushes were impassable. And then you had barely enough space to stand and then a solid rock wall that went straight up. And so I, I stopped to loot something because it was an area I've never been to before. And my companion dives out of the truck and basically just gets stuck right here, just hopping. You know, off, I mean, just constantly hopping. Um, and it's like, I had to drive away and let her essentially get leashed to me um, because when I got in the car, she couldn't get in the car. Um, so it's kind of um, kind of funny. Actually, how many are here? Oh, there's only two containers here. I don't need to make this uh, an outpost. Um, and then I did another experiment, which actually took me by surprise. Um, and actually, I can probably mimic it right here. Um, so I get in, my companion gets in, we're in a car, and let me see here. Uh, I use this side of the barn. I literally pulled up, um, I think this was Trumbull Valley as well. I was literally like this. Now, so before I do this, if you were the companion AI, how would you get out of the car? You know, the driver will get out the driver's door just fine, but you'd think the companion would magically, you know, jump across the, to the back seat, come out the, behind me or exit, you know, through, through uh, my door. But no, instead she magically appears on top of the vehicle. Yeah. You know. Now I don't know if that would work for me. Actually, now I'm kind of curious. Hang on, Cole. <laughs> you know what? That's one of the safest places to be. Oh, I agree. Now I'm. Um, but I'm surprised. You know, it doesn't get her trapped in between the wall. All right. So what happens if I try to get out here? Ah, puts me up there too. So, I give the developers credit for that one. <coughs> uh, let's see. Uh, let's go to that one there. Uh, except when you're driving. And then, oh, there's a feral there too. Um, then, you know, it cracks me up the companions and how they, uh, it's like, you have a, uh, a clear path to get into some location and they constantly will jump over the fence so it's like I run I run around here and Cole will jump over the just thank you Cole I love when my companion demonstrates what I'm describing no oh, Cole's a show off I mean Cole a badass in my opinion um, but yeah it's like 
it, it, it just cracks me up and especially when you got um when she's going after a zombie and the zombie's going after her and they keep on jumping over the wall and missing each other oh yeah i love when they go through the window for no apparent reason um it's like you know, I, I just literally walked through a door. Uh, oh, there's only two containers here as well. It's like, I literally walked through a door. You could have followed me through that same door, but no. You're going to break the window next to the door. Um. <laughs> I mean, there's, there's a, some interesting little quirks that... The characters in this game will do which uh, you know some of it's amusing and then and, and then on the flip side some of it can be annoying at times you know depending on what it is um i mean i was uh oh i was doing something i don't remember where it was and i've been on this map on my previous session but for whatever reason um I want to say there was a low fence um, or lowish fence and my companion for whatever reason just kept on and I'm standing still not moving there's no zombies around and she just kept on hopping back and forth over the fence it's like what are you doing I mean maybe she was getting her calisthenics in you know because you know It is at times. I like I said, you know, some some of the stuff the companions do. Damn, Cole, nice hit. Yeah, I got, I got a. Uh, well, 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 see, the thing is, though, was, well, now that one there, um, that yeah, that was unexpected. I, I was expecting her just to chop the head off uh, when I grappled that guy. I need to, uh, on my characters, um, I think it's powerhouse. Yeah, powerhouse is a good, good skill. I like it um, because you got to grapple enemies from the front. And if you've got a good, a good companion, you know, if they're following you, you know, go up to him, grapple from the front. Jesus! Holy crap, that's two for two she did that. Uh. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah, I know exactly where you're, uh. I know exactly what you're talking about. Like I told you, Cole's a badass. Um. I sent her boyfriend Seth to the legacy, so now, now she's got all this extra energy apparently. We could use this. Well, I'll tell you though, the one that I really dislike, <clears throat> and it happened twice. Um, it happened on the previous two maps. So I'm I'm working on my builder legacy. Now, um, <laughs> um, hey, you never know. Um, so I'm working on my builder legacy and I'm on my final builder legacy mission and you know when you're driving um, or when you're heading to that last location you know when you get close to it you get that big pop-up that appears on the screen saying hey you know uh, you know are you sure you want to do this now you know you have to either say yes continue or no I'll get to it later I am not a fan of that big pop-up because um, it's like the game is still active. Zombies are still chasing you or whatnot, or you're driving and then all of a sudden that pop-up appears and now you have no control over anything until you clear that message out. And it's not, and when you got zombies barreling down on you and you're struggling to, cause, cause you gotta hold the button there for like, was it five seconds to confirm or not confirm, it's like, Oh yeah, I forgot about this dude. Yeah, you know, but then I know that they, you know, they can pause the game on, uh, you know, when you're when you're offline, you can pause the game. But I know when you're actually doing like multiplayer, um, no room for that. Um, huh? 
you, they can't pause it, so I don't know if you know what the developers could potentially do to, I don't know, maybe make it so that it won't pop up if something's got aggro on you, perhaps. I don't know, or while you're not driving. All right. But no, I, uh, let me see here. Actually, uh, you mentioned something earlier. Da, 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 da. Um, I'm just backtracking through this because you mentioned something earlier and I meant to comment on it, and uh, I got myself sidetracked. Um, I thought you said uh, you mentioned somewhere earlier that you uh, you hit a feral, you ran over a feral. Yeah, it's like I, I constantly try to run them over if I see them. Those are the those are one of the few uh, one of the few zombies I try to run over. Um, and it, I mean, it's well, one, if you're by yourself in the car, with no companions, that's a, that's a tough job. Um, because you better pray he jukes the driver away. Um, but even like this one here, there's a, ah, see, I just, I, I, I never have any luck. Well, actually I'll say, I was, I was kind of figuring it out, and I'm about at roughly a 33% uh, successful hit rate, I think, give or take. Because um, I just n never... Now, maybe in a, if I was driving a different car, because this van isn't the most maneuverable, you know, so maybe if I was in uh, uh, that wagon or if I was in an actual car that actually could maneuver... Um, you know, maybe uh, my hit rate would be a little bit better. Try and follow me. You gotta get this done. You hear me? Um, and then also you. Uh, yeah. Now, is it now when you say new game, you're talking about uh, three, right? Is it coming out this year? <laughs> well, that'd be cool. <clears throat> Yeah, I mean, that's that's definitely going to be one of the games I think I will um, put on my, uh, you know, to buy list shortly after it comes out. Um, I, mean, I don't know how big the player base is for this. Um, how, how big is the, uh, like, even on Twitch right now? How many, uh, actually, uh, yeah. Couple dozen people streaming this on Twitch. Um, chat, that ain't bad. Um, <clears throat> but it, I, I mean, I gotta say, uh, the game has pleasantly surprised me because uh, I thought it was gonna be one thing, and it's yeah. Even though there's a lot of rinse and repeat. Uh, with respects to the gameplay and the missions and all that. Um, yeah, it still actually has its, its uh, yeah, obviously it's got its replayability. Um, Not bad. Now what I'm curious on, and I haven't tried it yet, I don't know, uh, I don't know how it ties together and I don't know if it, if it's a, a fresh game, fresh community type deal or not, but, uh, um, what do you call it? Uh, was it Heartland? I think that's that's part of the Juggernaut edition. Um, I'm not sure uh, how that game is. Um, I need to tell you something. Uh, go home, buddy. I know that. I just need time to work through this. Grab your stuff. We're leaving. Oh, I guess I'm taking him. Um, because I don't know if Heartland will take characters away from my main game. For my legacy pool, so I'm kind of holding off on uh, messing around with Heartland just yet. Yes. Um, but, but I'm kind of curious on how it expands the story.
And I know that I think the third um, It was a daybreak. I think that's just a uh, if I understand correctly, basically just uh, survive the horde type deal or something like that. Uh, that has less of a storyline and more of see how long you can survive. I think. I mean, I, I mean, there's story, some story to it, because there's some there's some facilities in the base. Oh yeah, I can't look at them right now. But I know there's some facilities in the base that only get unlocked during uh, daybreak. Now, I don't know if that means that they only are available in the daybreak, or if once you beam daybreak, they become available in uh, um, the base game. Well, I thought I cut its head off, but I guess if you want to hit it again, sure. Um, all right, it's back, I'm bringing him back there. Okay, we're here. Ooh. Thanks, right. I appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. And Cole just a slicer and dicer. All right. Agreed. That said, I gotta pay closer attention to what my team is going through. All right. Hey, come on in. Help is on the way. And as I Gracias. last mission or last mission, last map, because I'm I'm trying to you know I'm I'm cycling through my leaders, um, you know specifically to unlock the various boons, um. And it took, and I don't want to reuse the leader that I've already used, you know. So I was waiting forever on the last map just to get a damn uh, uh, trader leader to show up. And for whatever reason, even though I kicked a whole bunch of, well, I didn't kick him out. I sent him to the legacy pool. I could not get any new survivors to come visit. And then, and then all of a sudden I get like, oh shit. Oh shit. And then all of a sudden I get like, you know, four different people that want to join me. Now that's some good four wheel drive on a two wheel drive vehicle, I think. That's twice that, uh, that little, that second thing there almost got me. What is this? Oh, this is a factory of sorts. Well, this is the place that if I do trader on this map, that we will be possibly going to. I don't like the layout of this place, I'll be quite honest. Oops. Especially when I can't see that. Um, all right, so it looks like there's only this entrance here all right get off my car oh wait oh no i thought you were i thought that was him all right we're back in here this just in case i need to get a get out of here very quickly and i got room okay Oh, actually, oh no, so this is actually an outpost. Um, huh. Hey there. You have no gear. That makes me suspicious. Um, oh, it's one of these red talon ones. Okay. Uh, where's the red talon crazy people at? No problem. Over there? Okay. All right. Well, uh, if that's the case, then. Let me look here real quick. I don't think I can, can I actually make this an outpost. No, because that dude's here, but let me loot this place before I do this mission because otherwise I won't have the opportunity to loot it later. You know, I've always taken the option and never killed the friends. That's a nice one. 
You know, I wonder what happened if I killed the friends. Um. <clears throat> uh, you got how much? How much more room do you got? Okay, you got room for four more. Here, take that, 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 and that. Uh, there's a ladder. So is it, I mean, does it only take one C4 to blow up a play cart? Uh, Cause you're, you're doing a dread level, right? Okay, okay, I got you, I got you. I think that's everything. Now, I mean, so, so, I mean, pretty much uh, what I've been doing, I mean, uh, before I would go in with the frag grenades or the pipe bombs, um, but now I'm, uh, I'll go in with the grenade launcher, um, which, you know, four shots on a grenade launcher. And they're gone. Um, oh yeah, I mean, and that's the thing is, once you, you figure out a good strategy for the play cards, um, speed running them is easy. I mean, if it wasn't for me constantly stopping to help out every community when you first land on a, a map, um, you know, I could easily go uh, Get the uh, the twelve shell grenade launcher. Load up, load yourself up with ammo. Load your friends up with ammo, and you could easily just run around knocking out play cards left and right. Um, but I stop every time someone has like I need help and this and that and ah, you're lucky, Feral. Um, But yeah, I mean, that's the very first thing I do when I got on the stream, or uh, map, excuse me, is uh, our, our new map. Now, I'll set up my Haven device so I don't have to worry about the base. Check out what the sleeping situation is like on the, on the base. Um, just to make sure they don't get too pissed off. Is, oh, oh, too close. Too sorry. Oh, that's one way of I guess getting out of the line of fire. Stop shooting my van. I spy a screamer. Do you know? Oh, there's two. Uh... Um. The, the, that, well, I mean, I. I... Jesus. I didn't realize I was right next to an infestation. Oh man, I missed. How do you miss a... All right, well, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you take care of an infestation with a van. I got a hostile camp to the left. I got a hostile camp down there. <clears throat> Stay alert. The locals here are downright hostile. Well, you know, okay, so it's, it's funny you mentioned the uh, juggernaut, the hostile camp. So I did that on the last map. Um, and it was a, uh, <clears throat> the juggernaut had the advantage, if you will, because, um, it wasn't a normal building. Um, the, the juggernaut was, let me see if I see it on the map here. If I've got a, a similar layout anywhere, <laughs> probably not that I've un, uh, discovered yet. Um, oh yeah, so imagine if you will, prime example, the friendly faces here are a hostile group, which kind of goes against their name, but that's another story, at a mobile home park, which, which means they are outside already. 
So I, uh, I attracted a juggernaut down there and the juggernaut got one of them. And, uh, but somehow the juggernaut got stuck. He was literally standing in between two, uh, two of the campers or mobile homes. And, uh, he somehow got stuck. He, he he would have his running animation and all that, but he could not move. Um, and the um, the remaining two hostels were smart and stayed away from that side of the mobile home. Um, and they would come around on occasion to pop shots at it. Oh, I'll get you in a second, lady. Um, all right. There you go. Um, the other, th so you're talking about C4. So I, I wanted to, uh, there was a, a juggernaut that was on the open road and actually, I, okay, we'll make this a camp. Um, there was a juggernaut that was on the open road. Um, and it's like, okay, I'm going to try an experiment. Um, if we put a little work into this place, and so what I did is, um, I went and I grabbed some C4. Um, cause I wanted to, I wanted to see if I could, um, pick up C4 after you place it. And okay, I learned you can't pick up C4 after you place it. Okay, no big deal. So I set it off. Um, then, and this is where I kind of got disappointed. Um, I took a block of C4. I jumped on the jumped on the hood of a broken trucker or a broken sports car. It's like I planted the C4 thinking that maybe just maybe the c4 would actually be on the vehicle yeah. and so i start to drive away and the c4 is left floating in the sky so i was kind of disappointed on that because what i was going to do is i was going to do the old uh you know uh, um action hero jump out of the car let the vehicle roll into the juggernaut and i was going to hit the c4 and blow it up and well, that didn't work. Although, and I'm kind of curious. That's a bloater. I'm kind of curious though. How effective would C4 be against a juggernaut? Um, there's a juggernaut there. All right. So let me do this real quick. Um, let me grab a block of C4. Oh, wait, no, let me loot this dude first as well. Um, let me grab a block of C4. I've never tried C4 on a Juggernaut. Um, I've used uh, I've used uh, the 50 cal. Um, and I've used the grenade launcher. Uh, I may have even used pipe bombs before. Uh, where the hell did I park at? Oh, up here. Um, I'm gonna save you guys for later. Actually, oh no, that red marked out. Okay, they, they 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 keep on doing that on this mission. Every time I'm on this, uh, take out the red talent person, they miss mark on the map the red circle. Um, because that red circle that was there was actually for them at that food place. What they need are Rambo arrows. Oh, and actually, I need some gas. Um, give me an uh, arrow that has a, you know, a, a grenade on it, or explosive, or and give me a give me a fire arrow. That'd be kind of cool too. And I mean, you have bloater gas grenades um, that you can throw. You also have the bloater um, forty millimeter rounds. Give me an arrow that shoots. Uh, bloater gas, you know, because that way, you know, give me, give me, give me those three arrows, an explosive arrow, a fire arrow, and a, uh, uh, a gas grenade arrow, and do a, 
Only crossbow challenge run. I mean, I think for the most part, it would be easy, except for um, the missions where, you know, you, you go up to a place that you weren't expecting an infestation of sorts and uh, to rescue someone and all of a sudden the house is filled with all types of shit which oh, I see they made it back here in one piece that missed Yeah, y'all want to come? Did he? Oh yeah, they... oh yeah, that's a different zombie. No, oh. he's dead. I don't know how he died. I don't know if I got the. Well, I mean, I got the influence for it. That means I got the credit for the kill. Thanks. All right. The extra mile and you've earned a reward. Here okay. All right. Cool. We're good. Thanks. All right, let's go. Because uh, uh, Dylan here needs his rest. So let's go play with the Juggernaut real quick. <laughs> oh, perfect. Actually, that Juggernaut would be better. Because... Uh, well, no, provided there's nothing else out there with that Juggernaut. Uh, let's see. The bridge should be... Where's the bridge at? Oh, the, I just passed the bridge. Because... I was thinking one way you could set up a trap for uh, zombies. Get the boombox and C4. And then it's like, okay, you drop both of them at the same time. Except the boombox and the C4 use the same triggering action. That really wouldn't work. Actually, here, let me do it this way. Yeah, let me turn this. But uh, Whistling Mine would work, yeah. Um, but the Whistling Mine has a set duration, right? Or, um... Because I figured the boombox... Um would be good uh, I, I don't know the range of the the range of them Ooh, can I sneak up all the way on you Ooh, I've never gotten this close to a juggernaut before and I'm out. Cole Cole no Cole you dumb bitch <clears throat> well Oh, 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 he just belly bumped me. Run, run, Dylan. Run, Dylan. I got a rest. Oh, we uh, riled up the hornet's nest. Get off me. Unfortunately, the C4 attracted. Come on, bend over, bitch. Bend over, big boy. I don't have any stamina. Come on, bend over. Ooh, not that way. I should reload. Yeah, reload. All right. Okay, kill him! Fucking kill him! Ah. Well, that is not how I expected that to turn out. 
How bad? I know, I know Cole has been. She's got to be really hurt. How close was she? Uh, she's down a third, or down to a third of health. All right, well, I'm not gonna waste medicine on you. We're going back to base. Oh, goodness. And that was a deserved bitch bomb as well. I mean, I was in sneak mode. I didn't break out of sneak mode. Why the hell did she do that? Then again, also, I wonder how much, uh, yeah. Uh, I wonder how much of the, uh, I wonder how much of her damage was inflicted by, uh, the C4 going off. Because I think I can... Uh, shooting them won't hurt them. But I think explosives and fire will hurt them. You know, like area of effect, um, damage, I believe, will hurt your team, uh, your companions. Oh, no, no, no. I mean, not, not the Juggernaut. No, I mean, um, but I mean her, because I set off that explosion and she was right next to it. So I'm wondering how much of the, the C4 explosion um, she uh, suffered from. Um, oops, let me see here. Because I don't think, to say what type of uh, injuries you got, uh, minor concussion and then 75 damage. Both of those could have been caused by the Juggernaut. Um, because as many times as the Juggernaut slammed her to the ground, well, that's the, that's true. Um, but now it's Cole. <laughs> Cole's, uh, not, not. with my luck, um, let me see here. Who's, uh, who's got the most health? Uh, 148. She's at 204. 148, 136. Uh, we'll take Dylan. Uh, well, he's at 177. I mean, surely. Um, all right, enjoy your game. <laughs> surely it won't kill him. Um, oh, yeah, I'm on Dylan. Okay. All right, Cole. Cole, you gotta have your revenge. Uh, as soon as I can find the damn door. Go ahead, get your C4, Cole, and go ahead and blow up Dylan. Which will be interesting because here actually go ahead and take some pain pills yourself just because you may end up blowing yourself up at the same time oops no not that all right come here dylan all right we're gonna do this together okay let me take some more pain pills so i took just a fraction of damage there so I guess the C4 isn't as damaging um, as I thought, because he was actually right around that. If maybe, yeah. So I guess the C4 doesn't hurt. I guess maybe it doesn't hurt the companion. It sure did hurt me, but it didn't hurt the companion. Um, all right, those are good. Uh, let's go ahead and top off some stuff here. Um, yeah, give you the good pain meds. Oh, no wonder. Those are just the normal. All right, let me go ahead. And go. It's. Wait. Wait. Who's. Wait, do we have a visitor? We have somebody here. Or something's here. Um, oh, she wants to go look for a mace. Okay, I guess we could go look for a mace. Um, and at the same time, we'll go. Uh, those guys want a generator. Um, all right, so let me go ahead and swap over to. Tough job, but someone around here bullied us. All right, I'll have a. Uh, Actually, I can just do it this way. Um, oh, hold on. Uh, where do we drop this shit off at? Um, let me go empty the van first. Just 
another successful delivery. All right. <clears throat> yeah, let me go ahead. I think we'll be all right. Switch to Vera. All right, and then. Um. Come here, Cole. We change to you, and then we'll grab a uh, loom. All right. All right. So we will go find you a mace. I mean, the problem is you don't want to use a mace. You've been trained up with a blade. Um. So. I mean, we'll find the mace for you, but, um, boy, for your lost ancestral mace, as in, like, a family heirloom? And, uh, okay, so, there's the mace, and there's the generator. We're gonna go grab the generator, take it to, uh, these folks first, and then, uh, let's see here. Uh, those are good damage-wise. I've got plenty of generators in here. Uh, I can give up a generator. Um, where's the generator? It is all right. Also, just out of curiosity, how many? Uh, I got four of those, which is nice. I, I should give start giving some of those to some of the people I send to. Um, next time I send someone with computer skill to um, Legacy, I think I'll give them that network signal thing because. They'll be the ones that would upgrade the outpost uh, command center. But before I do this, I'm gonna grab me some water. So I'll be back in just a few minutes.
All right, so uh, these two are good to go. Let's go drop off. Uh, go drop off the generator. Uh, let's get another can of gas and a repair kit real quick. I got to drop this off soon. No, uh, you'll be dropping it off into the vehicle here shortly. Okay, hold on to the gas for the moment. There you go. All right, all aboard. All right, so generator first. And yeah, we got time to do the ancestral mace. So we can go ahead and do a little bit more scavenging. We gotta find a better way through this. This one little area here. There's no. That wasn't that bad. That was a decent little speed through that. Let me go ahead and mark where we're going. All right, turn here. And then back here, that's right. Right here. Here you go, Ian. Ian. Thanks. Oh, Ivan, excuse me. You're welcome. Um, all right, so let's see. Uh, since we're in the area, let's go search. Let's see. Materials, materials, materials. Um, utility warehouse probably has materials. <clears throat> but we'll stop over here because let me see. That just has. I, oh, I didn't search that? Oh, I thought I did. All right, well, we'll search this here real quick. Um, get a gas rucksack. Then we'll go down to that medical place. And we are at how many people were at nine? Um, We've built up a lot of trust here. Let's not screw that up. the day gets a little better okay and it's a third items up there more of the same well okay I will definitely take as many gas cans as I can get you know we'll stockpile them up I got nothing all right Now we'll go get our medical rucksack from the um, army tent. Uh, what's that shed have? Materials, okay. And then let me just see if anything out here has anything fully identified. Uh, we'll go hit that place there and uh, loot that play cart um, here in a minute. Material wise, that person. this person here? Sure, we do. We were literally just here like two minutes ago, and they're allies with us. They are. Uh, they're giving us uh, combat resupply, whatever that is. Um, don't know. I've never actually used the. Uh, I've r rarely used any radio commands. Got some sitting ducks nearby. All 
All right, let's go down here to this tent. Did we get any goodies from here? I think I found our next outpost. Well, it'll be a temporary outpost at most. Uh, speaking of outposts, gonna drop that one. Oh, what am I doing? Make this an outpost. We're all set here on the new outpost. You know, a little more effort here could really benefit us. Some snack food, don't need. Bullets, I mean, bullets are okay, but technically still don't need. Um, gonna put in one of the cans of gas. All right, first aid kit, medical rucksack. There we go, that's what I wanted. All right, let's go ahead and drop this off in here. All right, so then our next stop is to get the hell out of here before the juggernaut shows up. We already made that a uh, gas station outpost, so I don't need to worry about it. Uh... All right, I'll go ahead and loot. Uh, actually, go ahead and turn off. Turn that off already. Nobody here but the living. All right, go ahead and make that an outpost, and we'll. I'm finished here. We'll loot the strip mall. Nothing in here. Hmm. Interesting. Sorry. I was just looking at something off stream. Oops. Take that back. Oh, actually, hold on. <clears throat> Let me go ahead and fill up this, uh... Let me fill this up now. There's a visitor here. I'll make them comfy until you can talk to them. Uh, potential new recruit. Maybe. We'll find out here in a second. Uh, I don't need materials. Um, uh, actually, how many materials do we have at base? I mean, our limit is, what, 35? Yeah, go ahead and we'll take this set of materials, why not? Alright. Let's head on back to base and... Uh, that mysterious, uh, visitor, actually. Yeah, the vehicle. With the rucksack away. He'll stay there for... I think he'll stay there for roughly... I don't know. Oh, he'll stay there for a little bit. Um, let's go ahead and search the strip mall and then we'll search the ammo place. Might as well since we're here. We're zombie free for now. Because if it's a new recruit, I'm, I don't necessarily need... Um, yeah, I do need one more new recruit. Because uh, I'd like to have a full set of... Um, what do you call them? Full set of uh, fresh leaders for the next uh, set of maps. But... Uh, um... 
Worse comes worse, I can always just pull someone from Legacy to fill in the gaps. <clears throat> Which might actually be what we do. Because for the most part... Hey, we need a hand over here. Strength in numbers, right? Alright, uh, clean slate. Why are you always getting stuck, lady? Uh, clean slate, I believe, is... Basically cleared out infestations or whatnot, which, you know, um, yeah, would be a good thing because the infestations are kind of growing a bit. Uh, one more. So what we can do is go talk to the mysterious stranger. If he's a new recruit, then we can, uh, Bring him on and uh, go clear out infestations. Oh, great. Another freak. Where? Barrel back there. Okay. Barrel is the one we definitely want to keep an eye on. All right. Let me just take a look here, real quick. So, Builder, Sheriff, Warlord. Um, trader. Okay. And then we have another trader. Um, you are a warlord. You're a sheriff. All right. So I need a new builder. Um, or a fresh builder that hasn't been a, uh, what should we call yet? Leader yet. We got Collins, he's a builder, but he's already been a leader. And we have Chang, Should be safe here for the moment. Um, he's a builder. Actually, no, Collins is a trader, excuse me. Collins is a trader. Um, it was a, a power nap. He was a power nap, was our other builder, and we just sent him legacy. Um, time to move on from here. I'm trying to decide who is going to go to Legacy next. Um, Cause I'm going to get to a point where I have a core group of way too noisy. Well, it didn't uh, get the attention of the horde, so that's good. No yeah, here. The, the plan is we get our a core set of eight and then for the new um, and what we'll do is once the three that we have for the next difficulty of all been leaders we'll start hitting legacy and pulling a legacy member to be a leader on a map. Um, where's the object at? I don't think it's not out back, is it? On the roof? I don't think it's on the roof. Could be. Mm, no. I'm missing one search area. Where is it at? Why are you getting... Why are you freezing like the game's lagging? Um, where is it at? Oh, copy machine? That, oh, no, okay, I see it flashing now. Yeah, sometimes the car lights... Actually, make it more difficult to see sometimes. <clears throat> Locked. Oh, try the other door. Oh. Should be safe here for the moment. Well. Thanks, for Cole, for opening the door after 
I started. Or you're not cold. Thanks, Vera. Better than a kick in the teeth. Uh, I'd almost argue that most things are better than a kick in the teeth. The day gets a little better. All right, leave the food behind. This actually, we should be over on our food, I think. Right? Are we over on our food? As far as making it? Oh yeah. Yeah. So nine, eleven. Yeah. So we're good on food. All right. Let's go over to the ammo cop place. Then we'll head on back to base. The thing what we'll do is we'll just, uh, cause it tells me up here, it's got four containers. So <clears throat> I can put stuff on uh, Vera and I can carry stuff. Which is interesting cause I, I don't think I've, oops, I don't think I've ever seen a, uh, an ammo place. It's only had space for four, or uh, had four containers. They liked you, girl. They all wanted a hug. All right. He's close, but he's on the other side of the fence. So I think we'll be okay. Until he gets within, I think, 50 or so. Uh, I don't think we'll have to worry about him. And he's... He's staying out there. Take that. I gotta drop this off soon. Okay, that one's all you. However, oh, that broken window, okay. Uh... I saw that it took you a whole bunch of hits to take it down. <clears throat> We're zombie free for now. You know, if anything, Knock this place off the search list. Yeah, I'm kind of disappointed in this place. It's been picked clean before we got here. Right. Let's uh, let's head on back to base. Because then they want help as well. And like I said, I'm presuming that they want help with an infestation. I believe that's what the clean slate um, request normally is. Because we got a juggernaut. All right, so still trying to. I gotta come up with, like I said, a good, good driving path for uh, up here. This corner here isn't an issue. Because I can cut across grass easy enough. And I can, you know, that's easy. It's this one right here. Is, I mean, as you make the walk, well, well, as if you should drive properly. Get off my car. Let's take the wide turn through there. Alive, sunshine. We've got a feral on our hands. Oh, come on, feral. Oh, you can't even... That door. You can't even, uh... Uh, open and close the door with him. 
Interesting. All right. Now let's go ahead and fix the door. Since we're here. Oh, you know what's kind of cool? The door that used to be here is gone. So it's like we actually took the door that he ripped off and put it back on. All right. Okay, so that's, uh, now is that our ammo threshold, 85? No, that's actually over. Um, let's go ahead and put, um, shit, uh, what do I want to make? Do I want to make those, or do I want to... Uh, let me take a look at my inventory. You know what I wish I had is like a... I don't know, a companion app for this game. That you could kind of see what's... Uh, see what's in your storage. Um, <clears throat> Alright, so let me see here. You know what, let me do this. Um... I'll just do my own little offline thing here. So, you got 22s, you got 9, you got, uh, what else we got? 22 9s, um, 45, 57, uh, you got 357, you've got shotgun, oops. Uh, you, oh, I'm sorry, that's 44. 44 Magnum. Then shotgun, right? And then 556. Five, and 762. And then the 50. And then the 40. Alright, so I'm gonna do it this way. Uh, Two stacks and 740, okay. And then the nine, we got three stacks. And four, four, four. The 45. Uh, 45, we got two stacks. And 638. The 357, or I'm sorry, the 45, we have, hold on, point, 9 mil, and the 45 is 2 plus, yeah, the 357 is 1 stack, and 294, and the 44, 1 stack, and 2, 40, the shotgun, two stacks, and 489, 556 five, is two stacks, and 428, uh, 762 is two stacks, and 970. Uh, the 50 is at 385, and the grenades are at 497. Okay, so, uh, um, we'll go ahead and, um, I don't use the 44s that much, but you know what? Let's, let's get everything up to at least two stacks. So, um, do I have one that gives me the, f uh, so I want the 44 and the 357. Uh, where's the 44, 357? Yeah, so we'll go ahead and get those up to two stacks. Uh, medicine wise, how are we doing? Medicine, we got room for five more before it goes over. And fuel, we got a little bit more. Um, all right, let me just wait this 
Oh, while well, that's going on, we go talk to this dude here, see what he wants. I'm right here. I know, that's what I'm coming. What's up? Hey, you look like Collins. Are you Collins? Okay, you wanna go, uh... Uh, you wanna go kill... Oh, dismember. Um... Um... Dismember 10 zombie arms, huh? Well, you know what we haven't used for a while. I guess we'll use it here. Um... Although, you know what? This gun here should be strong enough to dismember, provided I can hit their arms. Um, you know, we'll do a, let's do a quick test. There's a, there's a zombie right there. Oops. Oh, now who did that, damn it? Bastards. Damn you, snipers. Oops, that was a miss. So can I dismember one that's already dead? So like, just out of curiosity. No, oh, okay. Once it's dead, shooting it doesn't do anything. Always hit him again. Well, no, not not when you're trying to dismember him. No, no, no. Graze him on the shoulder. Stand up. Be a man. Nope, that was a miss. All right, one more. Who's the lucky, uh... You! Congratulations, lady. Well, All right. That was exciting. Now that's what I'm talking about. All right, thank you. <clears throat> oh, appreciation. You know, need more of that send blocker bullshit. But I'm not. Am I full? Oh shit, I am full. Wait, where are you going, Vera? Vera? Oh, Vera. Hello. You wanna come here, Vera? Yeah. There you go. Stay with me. Here, take that so I can grab this. All right, yeah, that wasn't that bad. All right, um, that thing should be built now. Hmm? Go give me some more 762. Alright, uh, that's ready. Alright, so, um, go ahead and make some 44s. Two, three, four, five, six. Let's take it down to the last, uh, seven. Eight, nine, ten. What does that give us? Uh, for the forty-four. So that boosted us up a little bit, and we'll do ten on the three fifty-seven as well. Oops. One, oops, not hydroponics. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, and ten. Okay. So that's all we'll do for that. Those two. So. So one stack and nine forty four now for the three fifty seven. And one stack and seven ninety or yeah, one stack and seven ninety. Alright, that's good enough. Alright, so uh, I think we'll go we'll start focusing on the fifty cal and forty. Um Alright, um Let's go ahead head over here and see what they want. I'll be there to help soon. Um, they said a clean slate, so again, I'm presuming, uh, if I remember correctly, the clean slate had something to do with, uh, uh, what do you call it? Um, Storage is limited. When we ignore that, we lose valuable supplies. Yeah, we lost food. Whoopee. Um, now, does that affect morale? When, when we uh, lose food? No, okay. Uh, we got on gas and I just repaired the truck. But uh, so I'm presuming that this is a uh, mission to clear an infestation. Which I know that they, there's got a whole bunch of infestations on the, on the map. Good job, Vera. All right. What y'all? Uh, good to see you. Uh, are you? We need you to take out a zombie problem. Cool yeah. Shit. Hey, I'm in too. Okay, we're here. And these are brand new infestations. That it's uh, holy crap! Feral, feral juggernaut. <clears throat> Let me see here. Um, we're going to actually. We're tried. I was going way back here. Hiding in the trees won't save you. Oh shit! Juggernaut. Is he still following? Get out of my line of sight. I hit her in the head. Yeah, I'll take care of that. Right, that's one. And is this legit infestation? Looks legit to me. one you want to clear out right over here huh there's a juggernaut getting close to my truck I don't like when the juggernauts get close to my truck but I'm more concerned about the ferals nearby because I can always hop in the truck and speed off really quickly
Right, is there an actual? There it is. Okay, no more of those. Oh, that was a miss. Yeah, that was a bad throw. Good guys, have at it. Or not. I'm waiting to see if he, this guy pops over the. Actually, you know what? This has got a. Uh... There he comes. Ooh! Good shooting there, Tex. Yeah, I mean, holy fuck! You're definitely a keeper. She, she's just a badass with the sword. Um, where's the remainder at? This one back here. I mean, it's, surely it's not on top of this place. Take it. <clears throat> you want me to take you guys home? Good work, buddy. Don't stress it. Say, if you ever need backup out there, let us know. Take care, okay? Okay. No, oh, smart. Go go this way so you avoid the juggernaut. Um, they want food. Um, let's see, um, huh, I need to go back there, I missed a, I missed something there, um, and where are we going for you anyhow, okay, over there, uh, I'm sure we can find food on the way somewhere. Um, yeah, like right there or there, actually there, that's got a resource remaining, but still I missed, uh, okay. So over here, let's go into this one here. This place may contain ammo. I mean, this. this clear. I mean, it's. Looks like it used to be a hardware store. Got a whole bunch of plumbing. Engine cords. Um. And the day gets a little better. So maybe it was gas. Alright, well, we'll leave the extra materials there. Um. Uh, this place next door to so that one <clears throat> here uh yes here carry this rear if you wouldn't mind please thank you you know what <laughs> um, excuse me you know you think if any place wow double rock sack again or triple rock sack um, you'd think if anything, this place would have a comfy chair, right? That looks comfy-ish. That looks comfy. Could take, uh, take these chairs back to the, uh, uh, the home site. Now, what I want to know is, when we move from map to map and, you know, home site to home site, you know, how do they move all the gear? You know, it's not like I've seen a, a moving van, you know, heard that. you know, like all these mods that we have, you know, uh, and, and other stuff. Where is it stored at, at base, you know? Yeah, that's heavy enough. 
All right, here, here, let me give you some more stuff to carry. Mm -hmm. Good news is we're right next to the police station, so. Um, see any more zombies around. I'm hoping. Um, hopefully we don't find a rucksack in here because I can't hold any more rucksacks at the moment. Okay. Gonna drop this off. <clears throat> There's a juggernaut at. Okay, he walked away from the truck because we're going to need to go to the truck. Drop off these rucksacks before we hit the medical place. Yes. And yep, I, pre I prefer not to get into a damn fight with the juggernaut. Although, and I really don't want to get out. Uh, how many pipe bombs do I have? Just out of curiosity. That's right. Pipe bombs are at the bottom for whatever reason. Uh, I got 93 pipe bombs. I mean, we could lob a whole bunch of pipe bombs at him. Prefer not to. Because that's just going to attract more attention. The bloater. Taking a nap over there, maybe. But at this rate, I'm gonna need a. I'm gonna need to change the uh, ammo over to uh, the fuel. Uh, now, do I want to make fuel bombs or do I want to make fuel cans? I don't know. Medicine's easy because he's actually, you know what I can do um, now that the plague, uh, the, the blood plague is gone. Um, I don't really need that because we shouldn't have, <clears throat> uh, we shouldn't have the blood plague infection anymore. So what I can do now is not that there uh this here now i wonder if this we'll find out in two and a half minutes does that mean i'll get a, a greater yield in creating pain pills we'll find out <clears throat> This place is empty. All right. Drop this off. Go ahead and get some more uh, ammo. All right, then we're going to stop by this tent here. It's for whatever reason, and I don't know why, but I could have swore I did a full loot on that place. But it clearly is saying that I missed a search object. Where's the dr uh, juggernaut at? There he is. You drive all the way up here just so I break contact with him. What well, must you now? Damn. You know, I should really give you a gun for that uh that holster on your side too. 
All right, so what am I missing here? Where did I miss one at? I see up there. Oh, okay. <clears throat> That's cool. Um, let's see. You know what? That shack right next to us looks like a... Um, what do you call it? The garden shack. Seed shack. So, no, actually it isn't. Where are you at? Yes. Here, hold this if you would, please. Uh. Uh, we might find... Uh, I, I suspect we'll find materials in that there, but we'll still s take a look anyhow. I mean, there's a farmhouse down the road that I know will have uh, food in it, so we can just loot that. Yeah, leave those materials behind. But I found seeds. Uh, here, carry that for a minute. Uh, we got an outpost. Um, all right, we'll hit that outpost, drop some stuff off, then we'll go get... Um, actually, we need to make... Where are we going for this, first of all? You guys are up there. We got a blood plague there. That's well, that's got materials. So we still need to pick the food up. <coughs> Excuse me. But we'll make we're gonna make that an outpost. Uh, um, whoops. We'll make that an outpost to uh, drop off our gear. Right, I know she's starting to hit her fatigue level, so we'll uh, try to get this done sooner rather than later. Excuse me, Juggernaut. Oops. There. Okay, so that is the bloater. There's another bloater there. Ah, you thought you were going to get me, huh? All right, um, this one here, it's, all right, so that one there is the one we want to go to. Ah, uh, I see you, bloater. All right, and here's the food. I got to drop this off soon. All right, we'll put this in here. All right, and then we're gonna stop at that place, and we'll be oops. Not happening. We'll be turning that into a uh, outpost so that we can loot it. Yeah, I know survivors. I'm coming. I like how she ignores the one that was on the door. I got your food, Survivor, so you, you know, I'll just chill out for a little bit, okay? You know, just a few more minutes. Some zombies are still around. Nothing major. Ah. Uh. That should have been a clean hit on him. We're all set here. Anyone out there wants to swap? We've got good. Hmm? Uh, now see, it's that one there that is suspicious. Um, because, oops, that's not a traditional trader. 
I mean, a little bit helps. That could be the one that wants to do the ambush on us, or it could be the one that wants to sell us some what do they call them Z sense or some shit like that. Yeah, like I want to make myself smell like a damn zombie. Alright, we'll leave the materials behind. <clears throat> Oops, that's not the turn in. Alright, so from here, I'm gonna cross the river and head towards the toilet bowl, which may contain first aid stuff. Total knockout, KO Cola. Turn here. Scare the shit out of those zombies. Oh, okay, I know where I'm going now. We're going to this factory place. Oh, excuse me. And while we're here, we'll go take a look at the bathrooms next door. Uh, don't be a stranger now. Come on in. You know, you got a group of zombies outside, right? Oh, shit. Take care. Hold on. Sorry, I left the food in the truck. There you go. Much obliged. All right. Take care. You too. Unequip the case of honey. Hey, honey. Honey's good. I should have kept that. I should have found you some different food. Alright, so our next stop is going to be uh, to the location for this heirloom mace or whatnot. Um, because that is uh, a loom uh, primary quest. Yeah, that's heavy enough. Okay, well, I'm not in this bathroom. Ooh. Oh, okay, never mind. Uh, it's just gonna be stamina food. Probably. <clears throat> nothing in here. Or nothing, okay. Even better. Um, you're over there. Uh, we're gonna go up here first, though, so, uh, because I wanna, I wanna go ahead and get Loom swapped out. I see friendly. Cause she's uh, hitting her fatigue point, and uh, most likely means Vera is also hitting her fatigue point. We're getting close to it. You know what they need in this game? It's, they need a map that has a golf course on it. My son and I came through here on our way back from the Ren Fair. If only I'd taken a different route. But you think you left your mace here at the hospital? Damn it, I'm in the middle of my swing animation. No. He's, he's like playing a xylophone with his feet.
that's what it kind of looks like, right? You know, if, if you imagine the bike rail, rail here, or what it, I mean, it looks like a bike rail, but the fencing is a, a xylophone. Yeah, I mean, I, well, I, I don't see, uh, I don't see this place having, uh, I mean, maybe, maybe there's a lost and found and someone turned it in. And now we hope that no more zombies show up. All right, well, we'll claim it just for looting because there's a lot of, con a lot of containers here. The new outpost looks good, and I can already see the potential for improving this place. Oh, those, oh, that's right, those were from the bathroom that we searched. Water cooler. First aid ruck or medical ruck. I have a feeling what we're going to find is a note. The first aid ruck. Here, carry this. Actually, you know what? Don't worry about carrying it. Wish granted. Yep, there is. Uh, I don't know who's mace. Wait. Uh, I don't know who's mace. Blah. Consider this an IOU. Looking for. Uh, save my life. Ta da. Find me. Crap. My son would be glad that mace made a difference to somebody. But who are they? Where did they end up? We. It doesn't matter. We want the mace back. So is one of your things? Uh, it just says you're a single parent. It doesn't say you lost your son. I'm not gonna find anything um, else. So I mean, do we presume that you lost your son? Or is it you and your son were separated and he may or may not be alive? Um <clears throat> You know, it's tough to say. Oh hey, we can go to the value wagon there and try our luck at the lottery. Bullets are the only cure. Aren't they though? Let's go on this billboard real quick and uh, see if there's anything around here to scope out. Okay, I guess that's one way of doing it. Now, there's a screamer. All set to call his little friends. I've run over dead cows before, and uh, um, I think it turns them to, you know, like the dehydrated skin and bones to actual just broken bones. What does that say? Golden brick bungalow, huh? Now that is a sweet ride. What it is a survey car? I've never really noticed the advantage of the survey car with respect to uh, it's supposedly uh, able to, you know, while you're driving, it shows you uh, Nothing more to see here. Um, shows you hostels on the map. Uh, there's a feral over here. Uh, where's over here? Oh, there he is. Okay. Uh, no, I can't. I can't get an angle. From over here. And he's I think too far away for me to Yeah, he's on the if if he is, he's on the other side of this fence. No, well, if he keeps on walking this way. Oh, there he is. Ah, good shot well then again you know this gun here is powerful enough that you shoot him in the ass no nope. oh well that's okay um you shoot him in the ass the bullet will travel to his head uh food trader don't care about um all right we're gonna go back to base how many, how many infestations we got going on we got four in that general area and a fifth one up there. 
All right, so I'm not too worried about the infestations. All right, so we're gonna go straight, make a left, make a right, and then another right, okay? <clears throat> then we we'll go ahead and swap over to uh, another pair of do-gooders. To continue our uh, pillage operation. You know what I need to do, maybe, I don't know, is, well, I don't know how much I'd actually want to do it on the next map, but, uh, cause I've got a decent stockpile of cures, <clears throat> but, uh, if I were to start going after, uh, the uh, Plague Heart, uh, zombies, um, not my idea of a good time. Uh, go after the play hard zombies with the crossbow to gather some more cures. gas do we have room for okay so juggernaut nope dead, dead not um so this should give me i think what 10 gives me four yeah and how much gas are we over oh we're, we're right at our threshold so we're good on that um <clears throat> Uh, all right, so we did install the new meds here, or the new, uh, that thing there. Um, so, oh, okay. So it's reduced the amount of, um, it's, it's reduced the amount of resources needed to make them. So same amount is being made, but for, uh, one medicine and only two jugs of ethanol, um, things lying around and some of our supplies were ruined i hope it wasn't medicine for us i managed to spray straw into gold so that'd be a uh, food take this down to 40. all right that's good enough and i presume it was food just because we're always over on food I'm home. um the fuel i'm not worried about right now be wrong because I actually like it here. All right. Um, let me see something here. <clears throat> With respects to mods, we have a mod here. All right. So this guy here, um, it allows the creation of zombies. Uh, Okay, so that only allows me to create um, the ZI set blocker, Xenadrenal, then whatever the hell that is, along with the bait and those grenades. Okay, so it doesn't increase the yield of making cures. Um, I don't think I have anything that increases the yield of making cures. Um, quickly recover health, uh, minor passive. CNC meal, reference books. Filling, that's for the Molotovs and fuel bombs. That gives us uh, extra storage. That's a morale booster and a lounge. Uh, that's weapons and cultivation stuff. Um. Uh, weapon 
presses, mini bar, still press. All right, I don't, yeah, I don't think there is. Um, okay. Uh, let's go ahead and top off your ammo. I got no complaints. Well, I do, but I'll let them slide for now. And you got anything on you? Nope. All right. So, uh, check out the new stuff I brought back. Let's see. Oops, who are we going to swap to? Um, you know, let's, uh, let's have the combat brothers go out. You know. Let me see here. Yeah, Taka. You and your uh Someone needs to step up and take charge of this group. No, right now we don't. Switch to you. And Collins. All right. So we have the, the technically I don't think yeah. I don't think Taka was ever a soldier. He was a convict. Um and he worked in an office. He just dressed like a soldier. Makes him feel better. Oh, fighting. Um yeah, we'll give you sword play. Uh all right. So she's sleeping, she's sleeping. I'm gonna grab me something to drink, so I'll be back in just a few moments.
All right, where to next? Um, well, let's just you see, because we got nine people, so I don't think anyone. Will, yeah, it's rare that someone will join us at nine. And I'm trying to decide here if I actually want to let anyone go, potentially get a tenth. Um, skill wise, we want surgery. We want we want this because that gives us a boost um, at the uh, field hospitals and allows us to upgrade the field hospitals. Plus, um, she gives us mess in a day. We want her because not necessarily that, but um the herbalism gives us um medicine a day keeping this because she gets food per day as well and she can uh um do the pharmacology to make the strong pain meds don't need really could care less about firearms training um but we construction which allows us to upgrade um the workshop uh, um uh, <coughs> and uh, uh, make uh, the level six beds or the, the six thing beds. She's uh, the keeper for next difficulty. Same with him, same with her. Dylan, um, he gives us parts per day, which is nice. <coughs> he gives us bonus uh, storage. So 15 extra storage for ammo. Um, he, if anyone, he may be the one that goes though. Um, and I need this one here for munitions because he's uh, what allows us to upgrade. If we do want to upgrade the, uh, the what do you call it? Um, uh, what's it called? The uh, ammo places. <laughs> he can take it up to level three. I mean, we, sh uh, we should be able to get one more. In my opinion, but I know I can't call in from Legacy. Um, all right, but anyhow, where do we want to go? Uh, I guess we could go take out some infestations. Um, so we'll do a ring and uh, hit these four infestations, uh, knock them out. What do we have down here? Anything good? The strip mall that's not going to contain much. Uh, you can get some medical stuff there. Um, billboard, billboard. All right, let's go ahead and get some, uh, oops. That's a dude that, uh, you've got a shotgun, right? Yeah, he's got the, he's got the, uh, cold turkey. Um, and actually you, we need, actually, no, you're, uh, no, not Collins. Um, Taka still needs to do some work as far as this stuff is concerned. Oh, so actually, yeah, yeah let's go ahead and swap to him. Uh, we can get his computer stuff up by going and using something at the uh, command post real quick. Actually, I don't think I need to be up there. Well, let me go ahead and uh, oh, this is an announcer box. Never mind. Where's our, uh, there it is. Let's go ahead and... We're doing well, but sharing the load with a network could be good insurance. You know what? Actually, so this gives us an influence gain for 45 minutes. Go ahead and do that. Because then we can, uh, what you call it. We have some fuel bombs. Get some extra influence for taking out these infestations. Uh, so we got four. Nine should be enough. Um, I'm taking off. Don't wait up. Let's see. How are we on gas? We're good on gas. The feral. And now he's dead. Actually, no, go ahead and grab a can of gas. Um, and just, I don't know how much damage we've, uh, we've taken. We can go ahead and repair the, uh, repair it also before we roll out. 
<clears throat> okay, doesn't need repairs, okay. No, it doesn't, no, it doesn't need repairs right now. And actually, you know what? Shit, screw it. If you don't need repairs right now, then you'll be able to survive until we uh, get to an outpost or something like that. All right, so first stop is that one there. should be pretty simple to knock out. Provided I don't get the van stuck. This is easy horde. This is an outdoor horde. Fire in the hole. Hey there. We could really use some help from you folks. All right. Without so many damn infestations. Now, uh, oh, you know what? It's it's gotta take. This gives us. It's. Uh, I should have waited. Um. There's a uh, what you call it? It takes uh, seven minutes to get that up to get that activated. All right, well, let's do this. Um, let's go to here. And also, uh, where are they at? They're way over there. All right, you know what? These guys here, um, we're gonna go help them out. And we're actually gonna help them out fully this time. Those are the ones where you gotta babysit them, give them some food and water and shit like that. Um, well, not water, but food and more food and maybe fuel or material. So, because then you can, uh, not possible. Um, then you can uh, recruit the entire enclave. Because we can, we'll go ahead and do that this time just to see what happens. Because then, I mean, we can always exile them. Um, yeah, I bet I'll be using this soon. I hear someone coming from that. I get. Oh, great. We left shit lying around and it got broken. That food? Got a zed free zone here. Yeah, not worried about the food. So we've got. I think we've got enough beds, right? There we go. That's what I wanted. How many beds do we have? Oh, yeah, we got. So we can actually, uh, we can actually do that. Um, Time to bail on this dump. Let me do this just because. And this place here uh, should have food. You know, the other door is open, right, zombie? You know, that gun's really loud, right? Alright, 
Oh, I thought I, I thought I heard someone else beating down the place. All clear. All right, we'll make this an outpost. Guys, guys, we got us a goddamn outpost. Oops. Yeah? I can already see ways to improve this place. All right, here, take this. Uh, take that, so you can put it in the truck. And let me see if there's any food in here. Is those people are gonna want food? I'm pretty sure of it. All right, cool. Uh, we'll only take one food Set though. For this place. Leave that food behind. All right. <clears throat> And let's see here. Your uh, give me uh your medicine. Uh, let's see, were there any materials left behind here? Uh, let's go over there real quick. Actually, we'll drive. As I grab, you know, pretty much. I know they won't need ammo because they don't have any damn weapons. But maybe they'll want materials. So we'll grab some materials. You know, we'll, we'll basically grab the gambit. Ain't scared of no Zeds. All right, cool. That's exactly what I wanted. <clears throat> so, yeah, we'll you know screw it. Search the rest of the place. All right, cool. Dented can. Oh, gotta take that. Gotta have your beer. All right, go ahead, head on down there now. You'll see me soon. Thanks. Sorry, one moment. All right, where were we at? Oh yeah, I hear a feral. Juggernaut stomping around up there. Well, that's a juggernaut stomp all he wants. Loader. Uh, another feral. Now there was a juggernaut up here, I believe, right? Yeah, there is. And there's a feral right by those guys too. Hop over a fence. He's coming for us. He's trying to figure out how to get over here. He doesn't know how to get it to us.
Oh, you're in my fucking way. God damn. Uh, is this thing done yet? Yeah, so we've got a... Uh, um, influence for a while. Alright, so what do these guys want? I think the first thing they're gonna want is either... If you'd like, uh, food, yep, lifesaver, really. Oh, that's wonderful. Bye, don't get killed. So, we shouldn't do that. Yeah, I'm gonna take a chance this time. Um, let me let me see Stop. which, uh, no, I don't want to trade. I want to see. So, you're a chemist, that's good, How have you been? and you are open, which is good. And um, your computers, okay. I mean, so you guys aren't completely useless. Um, Later. Yeah. Uh, what do you guys have? I'm feeling you and me can do business. Sure. Sounds good. Bath bomb, cruelty free and ve vegan friendly, moisturizing oils. All right. Well, if you can. Thank you for that. You were just in time. No biggie. Uh, that really wasn't smart. No, I'm I'm telling you, you know, I'm taking a chance on this one. We're gonna get this enclave and um since we're not getting any single members that wanna join us. After I think it's the third the third uh iteration, they'll say, Hey, let us join you. And we're gonna let them join us this time. Worse comes worse, I exile their ass, right? Help me, anybody! Help me, Rhonda! Oh, sorry, wrong thing. <laughs> Zombies at every o'clock. That's an interesting way of describing it. Wanna help finish some work here? Before more zombies show up? Uh... Yeah, sure, go ahead. Protect you for two minutes. And stay out! I said stay out. Not today. I warned you. Screamer. Where's the screamer at? So oh shit, we got two screamers. That shut you the fuck up. You scary as hell. No, that guy was scary as hell in this light. No screamer coming up. No, you're in my way, lady. I can't, you know, I can't go through you. Jesus, but did you put on some zombie cologne or something lady or perfume that attracts all these ladies? I owe you for that one. All right, what are you giving us? There was a bigger way I could show my gratitude, but this reward will have to do. But yeah, you know what? A rucksack of ammo is fine with me. These must be crawlers. All right. Uh. 
let's go ahead and head to the next infestation. Uh, and since we're over here, I guess we'll start with that one. Nothing else, right? Just a trader on the map, which is a food trader, which not worry about him or her. Yo, zombie, hang off. Does this place have windows? Yeah, it does. Stations are getting back under control. Wow. A whopping bonus four influence. Don't shoot the truck, dumbass. <laughs> you know, that bonus influence really didn't seem to be all that great. You know, just saying. Right, let's go uh, take out this infestation. And then we'll go get the, uh, come back for the fuel depot. Oh, I also want to take a look at the bounty broker for something. I just want to see what's... What, uh... What is expiring at the, uh... End of the month. Oh, uh, game? Um, game. That was weird. He, he he got stuck in a weird. I don't know. It's like he, he was automatically walking, and I wasn't holding the keyboard uh, or any control keys. All right, we'll go up there next. That was also a great, a uh, great one there, because he got uh, all of them on one fuel bomb. Game Horde! <laughs> well, you could have been a little bit quieter. Good throw. I'm sorry, lady. That was just station bullshit is now yesterday's news. That was just rude of me to knock you down like that. <clears throat> right. Guys, guys, we got us a goddamn outpost. 
Man, this guy's. Yeah, you know, he's. This guy's got a lot of enthusiasm. Oh, okay. I got. Sorry. Um. Uh. Ah, okay. Sorry, I just... I was just noticing something, but okay. Um... Let's... Let me have to... Okay, well, anyhow, all the uh, infestation are done with now, so that's good. Guess that's it for this place. Okay. Drop this off. And uh well oh, there's a gun place right next door to it too. See how many uh how many loot containers you're gonna have? Five. Uh we'll go ahead and we'll drop this and just get another uh turn this into an outpost. Just because eh, maybe we'll get some a lot of goodies out of this gun place, who knows? Say hello to your new outpost. And with a little more effort. This place could really shine. Waste of time. This load's gonna wear me out. I've seen enough of this place. Let's go. All right, let's go. And uh, we'll go ahead and also get you some more medicine while we're here. All right. Where to next? Um, <clears throat> so, food. These question marks, I don't have much faith in them having anything good, per se. You got a fuel storage there. Uh, you know what? Let's go to the, that billboard. And sort of scope some of the area out. I know th these things here are going to have materials. Because those are unfinished houses and... They normally all have materials. Yo, they're closing in from every side. Well, are you still staying on the truck? You are. That's funny. No, uh, that's fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, you magically spawned up here. It's like, what the hell just happened? Why did I jump for? I didn't hit the jump button. All right, so that shows us some stuff over here. Most of which is not going to have anything of any value. A lot of materials, but again, I don't really need materials. I got cars full of materials. We got a gas station there. We do have another infestation there we can take out. We've got something we can use your help with. Bullets. All right, I can go get, give you some bullets, I suppose. Um, I think I've got a, yeah, I got a rucksack of bullets in the car. Actually, let's go over to that farm. <clears throat> Cause I got bullets on my back. Um, okay. 
Hey, I got uh, an extra thin bullet inside. Get him. Don't tease the zombies. That was just mean. It's not nice to tease zombies. Uh, six containers in here. Okay. Not possible. No more dead fuckers here. Do a quick search. Guys, guys, we got us a goddamn outpost. And with a little more effort, this place could really shine. And this guy's so enthusiastic about we got a goddamn outpost. One more down there. There's one there. There's another ammo. Good. And there's one right there. Okay. <clears throat> That's the food. Um, this one here. Another rock, uh, uh, ammo rucksack. Cool. Here, carry this for a minute, buddy. And... Missing one search location. Wait, I see it. I'm done scoping out this place. Cool. Yeah, I'll take that. All right, let's go. Um, we'll come back for the f uh, that later. Uh, let's go ahead and bring this to them. Be there as quick as I can. We'll just, we'll just go straight across. Loader. Oh, okay. I thought that was a bloater there for a second. Like, oh shit. Oh, hello. Well. All right, turn that off. Guys, guys, we got us a goddamn outpost. <laughs> With a little more effort, this place could really shine. Now, show some more enthusiasm and feel like we got ourselves a motherfucking outpost. That's how you do it. New place to put it. Oh, whoops. Yeah. Here, carry this one for a minute. That's one of the last things you expect to find at a medical camp, right? Or trauma tent? 
Oh no, no, because actually no, it makes sense. So when the soldiers come in after being uh, injured, um, you gotta put their gear somewhere, right? Yeah, that's what that is. Uh, um, did I pick up shotgun shells here? I must have. Okay. All right, I'll take that ammo off your back again. All right, next stop, Cross River. Oh, excuse me. Oops. Um, okay. You were scaring me there for a minute. It's like, no, don't, don't, don't let me not f be able to flip this. Hey guys, we're here. Well, thanks. You're welcome. See you soon, yeah? Maybe. Maybe not. All right. All right, so now from here, um, well, there's a fuel pump over there. Uh, let's check out the barns. This, you know, maybe we'll get an ammo rucksack from them. You know you're just attracting every single zombie in the area to us. Don't fish that away. All right. This place looks safe for now. All right, so all we're looking for, or all we're hoping to find here, I should say, is ammo. <clears throat> well, at least it's something. Just what the doctor ordered. You no, know, the doctors haven't requested a portable generator yet. All right, we hit our fatigue point. So we're gonna go ahead and finish searching these three locations and then head, head on back to this base and swap them place. out. Uh, go put the generator in there just because of the, the weight. And yeah, screw it, Dri go ahead and drive. It must be nice to have your own gas station at your house. Oh, I hear a juggernaut somewhere. I see him. How much time do I have left on that bonus? 17 minutes. Okay, that's plenty of time. Is <clears throat> get back to base and turn in, uh, turn the rucksacks. Yeah, it's not gonna give me that much of a bonus and in influence, but still, it'll give me some. No checks accepted. You accept zombie ears? 
You know, that's uh, the typical currency used in the zombie apocalypse, right? I mean, at least they did in Days Gone. I see a screamer over there. Just because I want to shoot the screamer. Well, no, I'm trying to finish him, not talk to you. I wanted to talk to you. I'd say, hey, Collins, I want to talk to you. Uh, we got six containers here. <clears throat> okay, we're going to go ahead and make this an outpost after. Can't do it. All right, let's go turn this into an outpost. Actually, if we're gonna turn this into an outpost, let me go ahead and grab the generator. This load's gonna wear me out. Well, yeah, it's okay. You're gonna go to bed here in a moment, and we'll bring two new people into the mix. Man, I'm out of gas. No Zeds around. Maybe we're making a dent in the fuckers. Oh, nope, we gotta turn off outpost. Not possible. Mark this place on the map as our new outpost. You know, I can already see ways to improve this place. Now, why don't you want to pick up that shovel right there? I mean, <clears throat> it looks in good shape. Food, which we'll leave behind. Hey, you think you can lend us a hand? We'd appreciate it. Ammo, which we'll take. Uh, that's what they all say. They all say it's urgent. Where am I going to fit that? Well, actually, you know what you need to do while I'm thinking about it? Yeah, go ahead and fix that. I just noticed. Time to bail on this dump. <laughs> yeah, that's... That's the way to do it. All right. Um, who are these people? Um, network agent, huh? But network agents are normally, you know, uh, safe people to go uh, work for. They don't shoot you in the back or the front, generally. Get in. There's a bloater right there, I just noticed. Yo. Although I'm guessing this is going to be, hey, uh, a couple of our folks or one of our folks went scouting and hasn't returned. Uh, I only see one in here, so what's the story, dude? Hey. I'm with the network. I was wondering if you're interested in helping us out. Uh, yep, I knew it. Okay, good to hear. All right, that's just, that's just around the corner. Where you hang your hat. But make sure it's got a few gun racks, too. Seriously, you can't have. 
have too much storage. Really, Collins? You couldn't have just followed us through the uh, the door like a, an ordinary person. I like to keep extra underwear handy. I hey, you in here? Okay, I don't. Uh, oh. Hang tight. Move, guys. I can't flip this if you're not. Bloater alert. Hey, it's one of those plague zombies. Ah. Fuck. I'm beat. Day 92. Get out of the damn bloater shit, people. Thank you. I thought I'd be in real trouble out here. Oh shit. Now with something bad. I'll talk to a member, okay, I'll talk to you. You really came through. Damn fine work. I got a feeling you and me can do business. Damn it, I I always do that. Heavy. What did you give me? I meant to trade with them before. Because network traders are normally good. Uh, what did you give me? Give me the ammo? No. You may have given me the ammo. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's look around because there were a couple of plague zombies in the area. Um, I got one. Uh, I'm not really worried about looting the house. All right. And that there probably just has materials. Ah, the hunter shed. Let's go up there. Uh, game. All right, so I got room for two more. Um, two more uh, rucksacks. Well, well, that was interesting. I wasn't expecting to kill him through the door like that. How much time do I got left on this thing? Eight minutes. Okay, we're good. Good thing I got low expectations. Oh yeah, his his stamina is in the toilet right now. Yeah, that's, uh, I'll admit that's a little disappointing. Um, I was hoping to find some ammo or an ammo rucksack there. This year, I would imagine we're gonna find. Material rucksack, maybe. Maybe a fuel. No more yeah, yeah, pop that pill. Why not? Guys, want a generator, huh? Um, let's see, it's a potential safe house. Okay, we we'll go ahead and make this into a. Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll give them. Uh, they want a portable generator, so we'll uh, we'll pull one from storage. This place looks safe for now. 
I know Chang's gonna be bitching and moaning about this. But guess what, Chang? Guys, guys. You're not the leader. Guys, then again, outpost. technically we don't have a leader right now. But that's beside the point. She had her 15 hours of fame. That is damn heavy. I'm done scoping out this place. Hey, here's the deal. You know, so probably next thing after the portable generator, because <clears throat> unless they're getting their own fuel, which I highly doubt that. Um, we're going to have to probably give them fuel next. But said, uh, I want to say there's two missions. Maybe it's three. And then they give us their, uh, which we call it the, uh, oh wait. Hold on, that's not the right ones I'm thinking of. The ones I'm thinking of are those guys, okay. Um all right, so this is this is a oops, this is a different group out than I'm thinking of. The feral. Oh shit, man, it's a feral. That missed. Oh, okay, this is <clears throat> this is the farmhouse crew. interesting oh oh I never looted this um oh yeah I, I can't loot this because they've uh they're here <coughs> well excuse me we'll go ahead and loot all this that's a lot of crap to haul around uh, where's my partner at? Are you my partner? No, you're not my partner. Where's my... Oh, there he is. Yeah. Alright, now, for real. Going back to base. Making it past that. Actually, hold on. Where am I? I have no idea where I am right now. I've never been to this place before. Okay. Uh, I think I want to go this way. Yeah, now. All right. Um, 
um what's the press set on right now um this is set on those guys um let's go ahead and change the press let's do some more 22 22 nines or we want to bump up the Let's go ahead and put the press on. Um, do we want to boost that? Yeah, let's go ahead and boost the 556762. Okay, they, okay, so they need more food again. Okay, which is fine. I got food in the truck. <coughs> and I got other uh, food elsewhere. Um, uh, we got one gas can, okay. Don't need the materials. Oops, and I got my. No, not you. Always feels good to stock up. All right, so let's go ahead and make some more pain pills. Uh, what's our uh, threshold for med? Forty-five. Okay. Let's go ahead and do just five, uh, do five fuel, uh, kits. Actually, let's do, like, that many. All right. Um, I know you're tired. This will, good, but I ain't that good. This will only take a few minutes. Okay, so we'll, we'll, and we won't even pull the stuff from there. Um, let me see. Um... Let's see, any of these have food? Huh, I thought one of these had food left over. All right, let's go to the fruit stand real quick, get some food. And take it to these guys. Couple of bloaters. We could build a game changing outpost here. Alright, let's get this food and get out of here. Hopefully that horde will stay on that side of the street with the juggernaut. Oh, that's exactly what we need. That's all we're gonna take. Juggernaut's still up here. Oops. Yeah, this Juggernaut's still up. I would have looked. I would have seen. He's right in front of us. <sighs> Alright. Give them some food real quick. There you go. Thank the Lord you were here. All right. It's nothing. So the next. More willing to make tough decisions. No, I'm. They'll be joining our enclave or our community, excuse me, here in a little bit. And you know what? Well, 
Okay, the problem is... No, actually, you know what? Um, Because I can get them up to hero status before getting them trained up in a uh, skill. So if anyone... Uh, any of them has uh, bone or a medicine a day as a hero trait, they may just replace you, Chang. All right. All right, so this thing here should be good to go now. We'll just alternate between the two. I'm gonna take it down to 50. I don't know why, I just wanna... All right, that's good for now. <clears throat> All right, hey, we're gonna take a quick break and then uh, we'll uh, stop over and see uh, who's gonna take over next. So be right back.
All right, so let's see here. Um, take a quick look at our ammo levels. Grab some more shotgun shells. Well, all right, so now we are at, for the 5.56, we're at that, and 7.62, oh, we got plenty for 7.62. All right, cool deal. So we'll go ahead and get this. Feeling good, feeling right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We'll do some more fuel bombs next, I think. Um... And what are we on our cures? Um, we're at 108. Got plenty of those. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let me see. Uh, let me just look at the wiki here and see if there is uh, anything that is good for the plague. Um. Let's see. Uh, craft Plague Busters. Uh, not that. Uh, chemicals for... No, nope, don't need that. Um, all right, so no. Okay, so just want to double check. All right, so we'll go ahead and... Uh, um, See how many uh how many okay, we got five hundred and eighty one of those. Uh we got two hundred and eighty nine of those, which yeah, we got plenty of stuff to do all that stuff. Alright. Um you have I think I've tracked the person who found my mace to a few possible places. Okay. Um let's drop off this stuff here. And what about you? Okay, let me take that and drop that off. Go ahead and, and top these off. All right, swap her to uh, you. Time to focus on my priorities. Exactly. Let's focus on your priorities. And then. Uh, We'll let you go. Myself being a part of this community for a long while. Here, you come with us. You haven't you haven't gone out in the field for a while. And while we're out, we can go ahead and take care of how many infestations are we talking about here? No, we'll save the infestations. I mean, there's only one, two, probably two infestations really. All right, so where are we going for this lost and found? One of those three locations up there, huh? All right, let's check your stuff and get it fixed up. <clears throat> you got good ammo there. And how about you? Let's see. Um, you're good on ammo, good on that, okay. And you get a can of gas. And a repair kit. Yeah, I'd almost be tempted. <coughs> Temporarily. To, uh... Oops. Let me see here. Uh, Material-wise... Uh, you get one there. So... For a day... Uh, who needs help? Well, yeah, we can go, uh, uh, we can go take a quick, uh, drive since we, uh, we're heading that direction anyhow. You want to get in the car?
Ouais. Someone else is nearby. No. Hey, no, chain's bugged. Hence the the fact that you can't see anything on her. Now, I can't change to her. Uh, it also means I can't give her anything right now. Hello, Suzanne. Um. I owe you one. All right, we can go help you out. Go help you find your missing friend. Where are we going? Oh, okay, that's actually good because that's still in the same direction we're going. <coughs> Excuse me. two of you are you okay um do I want the medicine or the ammo <sighs> take the ammo see you soon I hope oh no there were three of them no there were two of them never mind All right, let's go find this mace. So a left and a left. Oh, let me mark that. Oh, the creeper, right? I noticed a chain link fence that I can't drive through. In place and starting work. What do you mean in place and starting work? Huh. Okay, so it must be this place. Nice job. Just want to turn the car so I could, uh... Look out. Here it comes. Oh, you got your backpack back. Ugh. Hmm. Yeah. That's good that you got your ancestral mace. Found it. I'm not going to have you use it. Because I could see this. But you're as long as I carry that mace, <clears throat> I suppose he's here protecting me. You're uh you, you're you never find anything good. I mean let me let me just look at something here. Sword play. Improved by fighting with bladed weapons. So therefore Um using this, which is a blunt weapon, isn't gonna help you. Or me. Or us. So therefore, you're not going to use it, lady. It's going to go into storage. I need a little bit helps. I like how the music changed to like a, a, a like a soothing melody when she found that mace. Nothing more to find here. All right. Well, let's get on out of here then. Oh. 
All right, well, um, let's go ahead uh, up here and we'll do some more scavenging for a little bit. I'm not going to worry about the infestation. We're going to save the infestation for, uh, save it for, uh, what do you call it? Um, <clears throat> the new people. Our new outpost is ready for action. And I can already see the potential for improving this place. So now I'm also curious here. Uh, actually, um, so like the garden, the plague. Yeah, you know, you'd think she'd have a morale bonus for finding uh, for finding that which we call it. Um, First, that mace and Chang. Why? Why is Chang? Over here right now. All right. Well, in hold on. No luck. We'll be there in shortly. Cool. We'll start making some, some more fuel bombs, I think. Because fuel bombs are always fun. <clears throat> Alright, where are we going to now? Hang in there. We're on our way. Oh. You're literally this is kinda urgent, okay? just, just around the corner. Hold on, I gotta. I wanna see what the sign says. Real quick. It says, uh. Oh, I guess that means that's Latin for work together, or one together? Okay. Uh, let's see if this is actually. Uh. Alright, let me, uh. Oh, not German. I said Latin translation. Latin to English. Uh, where's the L? Latin to English. All right. So. No, that's not what that means in English. Okay, let me see. C O O. What does mean? Yeah, C O O. P E R A N T U R C U M V I V E N D U M. Which the English translation means they work together to live, not work together. One together. Now, um, let's uh, let's flip this around, and okay, let's type uh, go from uh, work together. One together. That one is uh, Cuperanto Unasimo. So either way, their translation is wrong. That's why they're dead. 
you don't know how to translate to Latin or Latin to English, then, well, no wonder the zombies got you. Okay, well. I'm here. The guard with us. All right, I think we uh, killed enough of the vehicle. Next wave. Okay, I'll guard this window. <clears throat> Y'all. The bloater blew up outside. Honestly, I was expecting a lot more of him. All right. Thank God you were here. Uh, don't need the materials. Catch you in a bit. Dropping anything for me? No. Yes. Yes. No. Um, I don't see anything dropped on the ground. So I'm gonna say no, you didn't give anything for me. All right, let's go ahead and uh, figure out where we wanna go next. <clears throat> um, all right, so we already did the gas station there. Oh wait, there's a fuel uh, fuel pump there. That one there we gotta be careful of <coughs> because of the, uh, the nearby infestation. So he said, streamer across the street, <clears throat> he won't bother us. I mean, we could. I hope, I hope Chang doesn't go all Rambo on us and go and decides to, that she's got to take out that damn infestation. It's far enough away that hopefully she won't. Because I'm far enough away, they haven't spawned in yet, so. All right, so then after this, where are we going to? All right. Um, Let's go check out that that barn. It, it may have a uh, it may have what you call it um, ammo. Way to the barn this way, okay. 
So you just gotta take him out real quick. Now there's a fire department next right there. <clears throat> the fire department may have uh, some uh, first aid stuff. This is a barn. I mean, it has the shape, uh, the shape of a barn. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to stay here long enough to search it. I can find a use for this. Uh, leave the food. What's in the lunchbox? Luxury potato chips. Oh, goody. Might as well, Ben. There's only one more container. Uh, clearly there's no ammo here, because if I find the ammo in this gas can, then we're in trouble. We cleared this place out. Alright. Where to next? Um let's see. Let's go up there and clear that out since it's uh we'll make that an outpost real quick. One of them's latched on. I know I'm Damn. That was a good fling. Yeah, I tried making this. Oh no, I know why I couldn't make this a. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, I was like, I, I tried to make this a uh, an outpost before, but I couldn't. And it's like, for the life of me, I couldn't figure out why. And it's because this was a had double coverage of a play card. Now we hope that no more zombies show up. There's a whole stack full of zombies outside. I'm sure they'll be going to visit us here shortly. That's a no go. We're all set here on the new outpost. And I can already see the potential for improving this place. Well, if we needed food, yes. But since we don't... Um... Oh, there's only two containers here, plus the heart. Okay. Nothing more to find here. And we'll leave that food behind. Although, you know, go ahead and grab one, uh, grab a thing of food. We'll put it in the truck, just because um, if those panicked, those panicked survivors may want some more food. But I don't recall, except if it's two or three missions that we have to go through with them. All right, from here, let's see what we got. There's a juggernaut over there. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's go uh, hit that billboard and see, uh, see what buildings are up there.
So, I like how that... I mean, the truck was already there. And then it bounced for some reason. Obviously, that's a mobile home park, but... Uh, Chang, you may want to start climbing. I mean, do you want to go after them all? That's on you. I mean, I know you can handle it. Now that is a sweet ride. Uh... We should jump on that outpost site. Nothing more to see here. All right, cool. Deal. Who do you leave alive? We've got a lot of infestations around. I don't like it. No, no, there's a method. For, there's a reason for that. All right, let's scan these real quick. Oh, uh, we got gas. Um, the clinic there, which we'll worry about that one later. I don't remember coming in. Oh, oh you know what? That rickety old barn must have had a, uh, but yeah, it did. Uh, all right, so we'll get stop at the gas, and then we'll still uh, swing by the peeling blue shed. Hey, look, trying at Legos. Oh, this is actually a double search wall. <clears throat> Not a double search area, but this is the... Uh... This is uh, where that crane is, or that crane looking symbol. But one of these is gonna have materials, probably this. We'll leave that behind. times I've picked up that same note <clears throat> yeah I'm gonna have to you know next time I get back to base I'm just gonna take a quick glance at these notes yeah. and see how many of them uh, are the same because I th think the notes will stack if they're the same uh, I'm definitely gonna have plenty of fuel to make some more Molotov bombs or gas cans pay on what I feel like doing So we're going to the shed, I believe. Right here. No more zombies here. So that's the Chang. Uh, 
All right, cool deal. for nothing Chang I mean I heard him a mile away coming all right let's go ahead and head on back to base I think that's I mean we got room for a couple more but um let me see Excuse me. Um, let's go hit the cell tower over here. We'll do that real quick. Loader. gathering over here See what could potentially be a military outpost over there. Could be worse. And if it is, then we can swing by there. Um. Or actually, that may be a. Could that be a home base? No. I don't have any bases over in this corner. So, I mean, clearly, it looks like. Someone that set up an outpost at the storage facility. We got the the watchtower, a couple of satellite dishes. Um here, take that. drive it no nah, you don't that's a piece of junk no that looks like it's still working nothing more to see here um We'll swing by that real quick because we can turn that into an outpost uh, offload and <clears throat> get maybe another can of ammo or a rucksack of ammo. Come on, girl. Today. Now I just got to find the entrance to this thing. Well, clearly not there. Not there. Hey, you don't know me yet, but I have an offer you might want to hear. Do you now? I'm right here. Ah. 
Not happening. Oh, this really? Oh, that's the self storage place. To say that a military outpost has got to have more than oh, not going that way. Got to have more than one uh um church container. Where's the flag at? Um. I see the three search containers. But I don't see... I don't see the flag. Flag up there? No. Where's the... Uh, where's the flag for this place at? Yep. Is it down here? Is this? No, that's. Where's... Really? Come on. Um, let's just. Oh, here it is. <clears throat> Excuse me. We're all set here on the new outpost. Gonna fit. We left stuff just lying around and now it's all fucked up. Yes. All right. So let's see what we the goodies we get here. Oh, nice. Yep, that's heavy enough. Oh. Here, you take this one. Um, I don't remember. Do I have any more room in the truck? Okay, I do. All right. This is... Probably materials, which if it is, we'll leave behind. Nope, it's not. Although I should have done before grabbing that. <clears throat> I should have gone to see what was in this case first, in case there's another rucksack. Okay, good, it's not. All right, well, we cannot take any more rucksacks. <coughs> Let's go across the street. Ooh, got a feral coming down the road. You know what? Seems empty here. That's a shame. Juggernaut and bloater. The juggernaut I'm not worried about. And with the pharaoh out of the way. Just don't run over the bloater. Right, let's see what this guy wants. You better put me out of my misery before oh. I turn and give the shit to somebody else. Oh, uh, you got, uh, you guys need pain pills. All right, they're on their final offer. 
We really need to have a talk about something that actually worked. I mean, of course it did. All right. So I'm gonna run over here real quick. Grab a set of pain. Uh, grab a cure for them real quick. I mean, let me see here. Just out of curiosity. Uh, I'm gonna put a marker there, but that's not where I'm getting their cure from. I'll grab their cure from my stash. The, the cure is a cure, right? No, nope, apparently not. <clears throat> All right. I mean, it's not that far away. Long as I uh, <coughs> excuse me, don't run over the bloater. All right, this should take all of four minutes, if that. And you know when we get back, I think one or two of them. I think one for sure is going to die. Maybe. Take that one out, Chang. Yeah, see, this is where I want to say some bad words. This looks like what I came here for. Nice. Hmm. Um, I mean, since we're here, let me see what this is. We got a couple other flashing objects in there. We could find some use for that, maybe. I mean, this place isn't on the map. So I have no idea what all may be here, but probably materials or... Now you're just hoping I can get the, uh, can get the van out of here. I should be able to. I've gotten it out of tighter spots. Now, what I'm going to need to do before I go visit the panicked folks because uh, I believe this is their final ultimatum. And why they say ultimatum, I don't know, because... Um, but we need to drop Chang off. Because um, I don't have room in the van uh, for uh, five. Plus, Chang's all bitchy and moany about them. And why, I don't know. The bloater's up and active. I just saw a freak. Yep.
So one of them's dead for sure. Let me kill that bastard. I know you guys are all alive. You're a lifesaver. Huh. Gracias, amigo. I'm surprised on that. Oh. All right. I want to see something here. What is what is her problem? Um Oh, you know what? It's probably the puts family first. All right. So, this is what we're going to do. Um we're going to cross this uh cross the bridge. Oh, that road straight. Um I find the bridge. I think it's this road here. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna drop Chang off because, like I said, I don't have room in the van for uh, all of us, and I don't want one of them to have to run back to the base because that kind of defeats the purpose of trying to get them all. And depending on uh, what type of heroes they could become, we may send uh, some of our folks to exile, or not exile, excuse me, um, legacy. I want to hold on to Dylan, because I want him to, he will be the leader uh, on this map. Um, yeah, so we're gonna make Dylan the leader on this map, I believe. Uh, Collins, we can potentially get rid of. Um, if we have someone that has, uh, I think what chemistry feeds munitions, I believe. Um, so we can get someone up to that and preferably someone that doesn't use a bed or doesn't use food am i going the right way no i'm not no no we're about to go the right way we're gonna turn it the next road um chang if we can get someone who's got a a similar medicine per day bonus um, that would be, uh, preferable. But, uh, so we'll, we'll play by ear. But first things first, though. Gotta drop Chang off. And get some gas. Uh, and repair the truck or van. I see a juggernaut nearby. Loader. Ah, uh, sneaky little bastard. He thought he's gonna set a trap for me and lie down on my entry path. All right. All right, um, let's go ahead. I don't need to drop any of this off right now. I mean, how much, uh, damn it.
All right, we'll do it this way. Yes. Okay, this might be too heavy. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and uh, dismiss her. All right, now let's go pick this. Oh, I need gas. This last thing I want to be, do is start driving over there and run out of gas. So definitely want to fill this up and do a repair real quick. There's, I don't think any of them. <clears throat> yeah, there's not going to be any rucksacks for me to get. And uh, worst comes worse. I can make a second trip. Stop shooting my car. You dumbasses. You know what suck is if they shot the car and it blew up. I would be so pissed off. Stay there. I'll come to you. Right here comes Shang. We shouldn't be doing this. No, the only downfall for these folks is, oh shit. Let's see how long I can last. We have a good relationship with these folks. Hi, ladies. <clears throat> yeah, let, let me take a look. Okay, let me talk to you first. Uh, let's see. So chemistry. <coughs> Excuse me. Let me let me bring this up here real quick. So chemistry. Um, let's see. Uh, community skills. Uh, chemistry. Um, will feed into munitions. So technically, you could. You could uh, take over for Collins from that aspect. You uh, are wide open, so that's good. And then you, I think your computers, uh, your computers, which doesn't really do us much good, but you may have some good uh, traits or stuff, but. Thank you. This really means a lot to us. And I'll look at them, uh, I'll look at them once I get back to base. Oh, excuse me. Everyone stay sharp. Well, them staying sharp is not going to do us any good because, like you said, I'm pretty certain, for sure, that they are 100% unarmed. Now they, I mean, they may have a close combat weapon. If they do, I'd be surprised, but... I mean, I've got plenty of, in the damn parking spot just the way I want it. Now, well, that's close enough. All right, ladies. I hope this doesn't backfire on us. This is absolutely wonderful for us. Thank you. <clears throat> this really means a lot to us. All right, so. I owe you one. Um. And actually, okay. Now. That's technically that's ten, eleven, twelve. So actually, we're good on food, which is interestingly enough. So that's actually good. Um, so let's take a look at these ladies. So um, who's our new recruits? Um, she will become a traitor. Okay. Uh, you lost your wife. Okay. Or or does that mean your lost wife? Uh, you got low stamina and low cardio. 
got a lung removed too. That, that kind of sucks. Um, so that's never going to go up. Yeah, you know, which kind of sucks. But you do have an opening here. Um, all right. How about you? Um, you're a warlord. Uh, stamina, low health, and low fighting. So you're fighting whenever it max out. Uh, how about Morgan? Um, yeah, all of you kind of, I don't know. And the thing is, every single one of you ladies. This fucked up ship could use a rudder if you catch my drift. Uh, none of you has any gear, hey, right? Other than that. I don't know if, uh, you know, I think we're going to exile all of you ladies. But you know what? We'll let you get a good night's sleep tonight. And then uh, we'll, uh, we're going to exile the group in the morning. I, I, I never done that, so I wanted to see exactly uh, how that would play out. So now I have, so uh, I can say I've been there, done that. All right, um, going for a save point to kick in. There it is. All right, so that's what we're going to call for now, and we will pick this up on the next stream. So until next time.